you know, the transformation, you know, first is results. I, I think we could talk about, you know, the results have been fantastic for the business. Um, we were really a business under our former owners, uh, General Electric, a business that was kind of flatlined. You know, we were okay. We were, we were profitable. We were respected, but we weren't growing. And, you know, that to me is always a problem. A business that doesn't have growth is always more risky than one that does. So in the last four years, we've been on a, a very exceptional growth spurt, um, which is somewhat unheard of. You know, we're an old company founded by Thomas Edison. So not as old as many European companies, but for America, Just a second. pretty cool. Is that a true story where you founded by Thomas Edison? Sure, sure. If wow. you look at, you know, if you look at the original GE, you know, it started with, you know, irons, everything as it electrified, small motors and washing machines, et cetera. So there's a lot of firsts cool. within our company. Cool. Um, but, you know, what we've been able to do now is really reinvent it. So, you know, we've been able to basically double the size of the business um, organically um, through, I would say, what we've been doing with the transformation. Because, you know, our ownership changed, but that doesn't really drive change in a business. You know, change has to come from from your people, from your employees, and then change needs to show up in your results. So I think the results clearly speak that something's fundamentally different um, in our company because it was one again was kind of flatlined, and now it's very quickly had an inflection point of growth, and growth and with growth comes profitability. So it's been a very good ride, um, but one during challenging times, which I think also talks to the. Uh, the transformation model is, is it a transformation that can work at all different times? Mm -hmm. Right. And I think everyone knows with COVID with all the world events going on, um, we've had challenges upon challenges. So, so we've been very happy with that.